What I would like to say is that I, I have to assume, and I'll, I'll come back to it as well, I have to assume that you're all very, very good at what you do, uh, technically speaking. So, you know, you write good articles, you're great with raw materials, and, and so on. Uh, all Trim is going to try and do is make you more efficient and more effective at what you already do. So it's not going to make you any better. Uh, I have to assume you're very good at what you do. You're a great salesman. I have to assume that. What I'm going to try and do is help you be better at juggling all the balls and spinning all the plates to be that better salesperson. Okay? And what I'm assuming from you guys is you all want to be more efficient and more effective. That's why you're here. That's why you're giving up your time. Uh, that's why you paid your money. Uh, and you know, the boss hasn't told you to be here. So that, 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 that should work. One of the challenges that I have um, is in dealing with multiple clients and it's the time management aspect of that which has always proved to be a, a problem on my part. Um, I've certainly found this day course absolutely amazing and worth every single penny. So family's one area, give us another area. Work. work. That's the one that, interesting you said family, because uh, most people will say work first. Okay. And then we've got three and four. What would three and four be? Social. Okay, I call that outside interests. Okay, and what's the fourth one? Sleep is part of it. Why do you sleep? Yeah, why do you rest? So you, that's, that's what I'm aiming for. You. Okay, it doesn't necessarily have to do just sleep. There's other other things you do that are specific to you. They've got nothing to do with work, they've got nothing to do with your family, they've got nothing to do with your outside interests, they're you time. It's, you know, it's, it's important to you. For me, home working is one of the examples. Yeah, so if you have the opportunity to work from home, then you get to see the family, you can time shift, move around a bit, and you're still working. Before you know it, you've put a lot more hours there. Okay? Everyone quite happy with that? So you can see what I'm doing in terms of trim and being uh, a very uh, selfish, personal uh, series of persons and techniques. What it's doing is trying to give you control yeah, of what's going on across the 24 hours to try and give you the ability to fight back against that and get yourself as much into that. I found this course particularly useful in trying to work out how to make the best use of my time and waste the amount of time that I normally would expect to spend trying to work out what I'm trying to do. Uh, it's been a very useful course, very enjoyable and uh, uncomfortable in ringing quite a few bells uh, for me about things that I know that I've been doing perhaps much less efficient than I should be. All right, that's from the first point, is trying to make Trim a very, very personal, uh, selfish uh, for you. Okay, you're at the centre of it. Okay. Next one down is paper-based. Now, the only way, reason I put down paper-based is when Trim first started, computers didn't exist. Uh, computers are taking off over more and more and more. It is easier to run the Trim course, basing the process and techniques on paper. Okay? In practice, they're completely adaptable for whatever electronic interface you use. Okay? So don't, don't get hooked up on this bit about paper-based. Okay? What I will say though, uh, as we go through the course, what you will find is that paper is, uh, is very, very flexible. Okay? It's adaptable, it's available, it's cheap. So in spite of digital, in spite of all the movements for, for computers, paper will still beat computers in certain, and quite a lot of certain involvements that affect your efficiency and your effectiveness.